Um, sorry about that, everyone. It seems that there was some sort of bug um, that popped up that crashed the game. I think I fixed it now. However, the thing is, uh, is that we did not pass a year and there was no autosave, meaning we have to start from scratch again, which I'm going to do. I don't know if um, that last part was a separate video or if this is still the first video, but we're just going to start from scratch again, mainly because um, we don't have any save data from anything else. So we're just going to go back, um, try to get a balanced budget. We'll continue with clergymen. And um, we'll get this started once again and hope it does not um, crash again. Uh, that would be bad. If it does crash again, then that would definitely be um, the end of the first video. If it's not already the end of the first video. Okay, so we are losing a bit a month. Um, don't really want that to happen. There we go. Maybe. 119. Wow. Don't even know what happened. We just fell like about 10 spots or something. Um, for some reason. Okay, our budget is much worse than before. Uh, military spending, that's probably one of the things. Yep. We uh, Let's increase education a bit more because the better the education, the um, quicker we do westernize so that's something we do want so one way I move oh Norway's free I mean it's a vassal of Sweden it's a satellite of Sweden but Norway is free so and Jan Mayen is free as well so Sweden just freed up a bunch of their colonies um, so I was saying one of the ways I do move about the map is by pressing the middle mouse button and dragging and I realized throughout all my videos that this is very noticeable, this sound. So I'm going to try to not do that anymore if I can. It's just the most, it's the easiest way I do it. It's instinctual for me. But I'm going to try to do that less. Oh, uh, we didn't actually set up um, alliances yet. They don't accept, so that's a weird thing. Um... They're like, no, we're fine now. No, thank you. Hmm. So the alliance we had with Tunis, uh, they no longer want. I guess let's fight for it. Or just increase relations for it. If we get to one year, the bug is most likely gone. Because I did, basically what I did was I replaced uh, one of the localization files with that of one of my old mods, thinking maybe something could have happened to fix it. And it was my Yucatan mod. So, there is a south and north Yucatan here. By that, I mean it's all north Yucatan. So, I don't know what happened. But this is messed up a bit. Just the name, it's nothing really else besides the name. New upper house, vastly more conservative, less liberal, less reactionary. And I guess that's good. Reactionary, um, I keep forgetting what exactly they do. Um, the difference, they have interventionism. Yeah, um, I wouldn't actually mind having them as a national party, but it's fine that we don't. We can change it whenever we want, but um, it's fine that we don't. Let's accept with Tunis. We now have an alliance with them. So, Texas won, automatically got annexed by the United States. And then Mexico colonized Oklahoma, so there's this weird in thing here with Oklahoma. Yep, yeah, I think we're good. The bug's gone because we already passed a year. Military parade, unmatched glory. And now we're, we jumped like 40 spots. We're now 79. Instead of 119. So that's nice. Good prestige. We're the 19th most prestigious nation in the world. Um, it's also surprising. So we may want to think about building a ship of some sort. If we do, it will be in Benghazi. It does not matter at all. But that's where I think the best would be. 
it would kill our economy. That's something that's very critical. It will do that. Um, so I guess we can wait a bit until that happens, until we have enough of an economy to actually um, build it, but for now we won't. Look at this. Bolivia and Peru are in three separate wars. Three separate ones. Okay. Um, I'm just going to move down here for a bit just to see what their troop situation looks like. I really should have made their capital Tripoli. Um, but, oh well, it's too late. Uh, they do have 12,000, which um, they would beat our 9,000, but with Tun uh, Tunis's 18,000, we could beat them, assuming we're organized. So we should either ally with them, or we should attack them. They're now allied with Algeria, so that wouldn't really be good. Um, minus 36. Algeria is kind of close. 85. So Algeria is the next closest nation. Egypt may be the best, but again, if we do ally with them, which is pretty far off, um, we would have to go up against the Ottomans uh, from time to time, which we don't want. So um, Algeria seems like the best bet. Uh, sent, mainly since all the civilized countries do not want an alliance with us. So let's just keep increasing relations with Algeria. Once we hit $1,200, I think it's uh, we would be safe enough to build a ship. $1,200. Probably going to forget, but um, that's there. Ottoman Empire um, loves Prussia. So that's there. A Prussian Ottoman Empire uh, relation that's really high. It's weird to me that Iceland is one province. This entire thing is just one. One province of Iceland. Meanwhile, Greenland is like five. So I don't really understand that, because Iceland's not really that bad of a region. Uh, Greenland is. It's all Arctic. And Iceland is hills. So, kind of weird it's only one province. We're now 1% clergymen. So, 1% um, of our population is clergymen. They do recommend 2% um, in order to be the most efficient. We could be higher if we want, but 2% is the best here, it says. So, we'll switch once we get above 2%, and then we'll probably go to bureaucrats, maybe immigration, uh, something like that. Algeria, we do have 4 points now. We'll just keep feeding it into Algeria. It's only minus 17 now. Yep, minus 73 for Tripoli. Algeria, it's close. So we'll just keep increasing. Dutch don't like the Prussians. So we had that big boost of conservatives to begin with, and now they're slowly dwindling away, very slowly. But the past few elections have been a slow drop of conservatives. And now it's at minus 20. It was like 10 before Spain's invading Morocco minus 27 it keeps going down um, for some reason they're still the closest though so Spain wants Taza as well as Moroccan Al Rif um, so that's the one up here as well as the big one that everyone loves the one that stretches the entire nation. Okay, so war between Portugal and Oman. Uh, nothing here. But Spain did win, so Morocco is pretty much completely defeated. Still don't want an alliance. Who are they allied with? Wait, too many alliances for me or them? It says too many alliances. They have zero. Oh, it's only minus six now. Okay, so we do have a general here, and he is brilliant. Great attack, great morale, better speed, great organization. Not really good for defense. However, that's still a great general. No negatives at all. And he's assigned to the Libyan National Guard, which has um, three irregular regiments to it. So he's our best defense, even though he's really good in attacking. So that's not really 
um, productive. Oh no 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 no! Um, don't know why that came up, especially, and I don't know why it came up so late. Um, that's the main thing because took a long time. I don't know if you can see this or not. I don't know if it's still recording. Um, the game did crash. Uh, so I just wanted to say that this will be it for this week. Um, come back next week for more. Will we finally remove this bug? Will um, we get this started and actually do something? All these questions may or may not be answered depending on if I actually, you know, um, fix the bug. Because if I don't, then this won't continue because I can't play it. Um, basically, if you see another video of this next week, um, the bug will be fixed. Either that or I'll just be too lazy to actually make something else. So, um, thank you all for watching. Um, this has been Victoria to Libya, uh, filled with many crashes and errors. I'm the Captain 47 and I'll see you guys later.